Hello guys, uh, this is TFXS. Once again, welcome to TFX family. Guys, I really appreciate and love you all traders in the house. Guys, uh, this is a special request for those people who have been requesting. Uh, there is some people who said that they would like uh, to scalp more in spike detector and they just wanted how they can take trades out uh, or how to scalp after the uh the spikes for 5g and say that they would like to uh to scalp in the middle of the game in between this uh triple uh sorry the the 5g or 3d spike detector and uh I was working for that and uh, this is how we'll be doing. It's very, very, very perfect and accurate. And this is why I always see when all traders comes together, when they brought their minds together, they can do uh, excellence and exploit my friend because uh, the idea you shared with me, I really appreciate and I have, do, I have done some just uh, adjustment of some settings so that uh, it may give you the exact uh, what you wanted. And uh, as we know, after the 3D spike, after the spike from the 3D signal uh, spikes, we know that there is a lot of uh, uh, of reversal or the, uh, the market reversed from that point and there will be a lot of spike. And uh, some people say that, that uh, when they trade the 3D or 5G, spike spikes they would like more to spike in the middle of the game before uh the other 5g or 3d spike uh, detector appeared to show that the the end of uh spikes and the reverse of the market and uh it is very simple guys for those who have our 3d spike detector system this for manual uh, you'll just contact me so that I can send you the setup because of the adjustment. And those people who don't have the 3D spike detector system, let me tell you, you're missing a lot in the market. You are missing a lot and you have no one to blame because you have to blame it for yourself because maybe uh, you don't know how to fight your fear. Okay, this is the system that helps all traders to recover. And uh, very soon, uh, very, very, very soon, well, the 3D spike detector EA will be released very soon. Very soon. We have been working with it. There are some people I've been sharing with them and uh, I have been showing them how it has been working. And um, they know that we are still testing our 3D spike EA and uh, it's already done. It's already, it's ready even for now, but uh, we want, we would like to release it anytime, but you can contact me if you're interested, but it's ready, we have been working with it in our live account, and it has been doing a good job, and uh, for those people who have, if you really don't have the, the 3D spike detector, then this manual system, my friend, don't blame anyone for you lacking money, or maybe not making it in the uh, Forex market or dairy platform because you're missing a lot. And thank you for those people who have been giving advice of what they, you are thinking and what to do. Now this is what to do. Let me show you something here. The most important thing we done, it is this trade line, which gives you the direction of the spikes after the spikes. And uh, this one, it's the one that will be giving you the direction of the market in minute one when trading the spikes. Now this is what to do. You just go, if you want to work in the middle of 3D spike detector, you just uh, click 3D, you'll just attach the 3D, the spike detector like that. If you want to trade uh, in the midst of uh, uh, 3D spike detector, if you want to trade in the midst of uh, uh, 3D, uh, 5G, spike detector you just double click this one this one will to, it will be with the uh, only the template will have on the straight line then i will show you what to do with our spec detector remember 3d or 5g or vector spec detector 
when it is spike, uh, it start popping up, remember that it will spike, but this is what I want you to do. Let's give uh, for instance with this 5G, because this is now is the 5G spike detector, as you can see, when it start popping up here, it is spiked all the way this way. Now, after selecting 5G, you'll need to add now the vector. The vector it's what you'll be using to uh, to to trade or uh, to take or to scalp uh, the trade all in the middle of the uh, 5G, which I mean that uh, which means that uh, in between from 5G spike detector to 5G uh, spike detector. Let me show you something here so that you can get what I want. This is 5G, the green arrow. This is the 5G. And uh, let me give this as an example. As you can see, this is a crash 1000. And in between this 5G, this is the trade line. And this is the 5G spike detector. It comes all the way from that area to here. There was a reversal. The other one, the other entry is here that uh, dropped all the way to where our trading line is. So in the middle of the game, uh, you need to scalp some uh, some reversal that are reliable with this direction of the market. This is why I said that you are supposed to select 5G if it is the 5G you want to use with this direction, then go to vector, then attach the vector. So as you can see, there is a vector here. And if I remove this vector, you can only find that there is only 5G. So trading the vector in the middle of this 5G game in between 5G to 5G before reaching to our trade line, you need to trade uh, a profitable or a reliable uh, trade here because this now, now it's giving you this direction because we have 5G here and we have the trading line here, meaning now this is a down trade in minute one. So if you attach this now vector, you'll find that there is a vector that will appear here, meaning that knowing that you are going with the direction of the 5G, you are not only supposed to wait until when the 5G appeared, then you close the market. No, you can close the market earlier. You can take the profit using the using the using the direction of the 5G and the trading line. You can exit the market using the vector. And at the same time, you can enter with the market through that vector because you are giving direction with 5G. And remember the trade uh, the trading line. It is the one showing you where the game is going. So you are using the trade line. It's a, a game planner, meaning that now this is the down trade. So when you attach that uh, the three uh, the, the the vector, you see that this is a good place to exit the market. And remember, the entry was with the five G and the trading line. So the vector will help you to exit at this place and re-enter the market when this vector appeared again because we're still going with the direction of the uh, trading line and the 5G. So we take our trades at this place. Again, we exit them here and there will be a strong reversal because we can see there is a 5G again here. Then as you can see, again, the market went never go to our, where our trading line is, meaning that we are still going down. And you, as you can see, there is a 5G here and there is a vector. So when the 5G now, because we have a 5G here, we only wait now for the 5G to appear here because we have the reversal uh, 5G here. So don't enter again with a vector here unless there is a 5G because we have now a 5G down here. But here, because we don't have a 5G, it's just a minor reversal that's why you're supposed to enter the market with this vector. Then from this place, because we have a 5G at this place, now you are not supposed to enter with that uh, this downtrade unless there is a 5G. And uh, the matter of the fact, I can see 
the 5G is here. So you enter that market again with this uh, 5G until we get the end of that market. So for instance, if there is, there will be uh, uh, maybe a reversal here only with the vector, that will be your exit point and wait another vector here and we enter the market because we have our 5G at this place and the market is downtrend until we get at this point. Now, this is what you'll be doing and this is what maybe some will not like, but this is perfect or the perfection of the market is here. After getting into this area, now we don't have to trade this trade anymore. We will be waiting until we get again into our trading line and in our trading line, when we have a 5G in our trading line, then we'll continue trading a sale. But any vector that will be will pop up in this trading line, even if now there is no a 5G, you can still take that trade, only go for like one spike, don't go for one spike until when there will be a confirmation of our 5G. So when you get the 5G again, know that the trade now will continue dropping. As you can see, now we have our 5G here. Now we're expecting this market to continue dropping. And as you can see, our trade line, the direction of our trading line, it's telling you that this market can continue going up because from a, a big time frame, it's a sensor in something like this market can continue going up. But now because we have 5G here, we are riding this market until we have the vector and then the vector will give us the exit point. There is, yeah, this is the vector. This was our exit point after entering the trade line and 5G. This is the exit point. Now we are in a, waiting for another vector here. Then we can continue selling that market before the market continue going up. It's very, very simple. And I just want you to follow that video closely and you will understand what I'm saying. Let's go to... Uh, another a good example in BOOM uh, 1000 so that we can end this one. The template is only with uh, 5G if uh, uh, now you are trading with the 5G. And remember the same method is what you use. If you want to use uh, all to trade in the middle of 3D, if you want the 3D, uh, 3D to give you the direction of the market, this one is very far guys. I can't see my 3G here, uh, the 3D is here, maybe let's say give an example with this one. So you can you can buy because now this one is boom. When there is a 3D here and the trading line, then any of the vector that will appear, any of the vector, remember, if you are trading the direction of the 3D, uh, 3D remember we are using a vector as our, uh, uh, to enter the market uh, with the same direction of uh, 3D and uh, uh, trading line. Let's go back. Let me give a good example with what uh, we can see here at this video of the game. Now, thank you. I think it was a network. You can see now we have a 3D here. And now we want to scalp this trade and we don't want to lose any opportunity using our 3D now direction uh, with our trading, uh, trading line. Now, you only need now to attach the vector because now we have the 3D. Now, every vector that will appear with this direction because now we have our 3D here and our trading line here, that will be our entry point and the next vector will be our exit point. So you enter that market here, you exit after this, three, uh, this vector spec detector, then when it start popping here at this place and because we know now it's an up trade, this is our entry point. I hope that is clear. And now this is your exit point, your entry point again, and this is your exit point. Wherever the vector appeared after the spikes, that is your exit point. So you enter the market with the 3D, you exit with the vector, but the vector that will appear in the middle of the game before we get to our another 3D, then we'll always enter that market with this vector and the uh, exit market with the vector. I think that is very simple, guys. That is very accurate. That is how powerful this system is. For those people who have the system, they know what I'm saying and you can contact me so that I can send you the template that you'll be using. The only thing you need 
it is to watch now this video clearly. Now, after getting up to this place, now we are, the, we are at the end of uh, this 3D uh, trade. Now we will be waiting for this market. We'll be waiting for this market until we get another 3D at this place and our trading line, then we'll continue buying that market. But after getting the 3D at this place and there is a trading line, guys don't trade another buy spikes know that that is the end wait until we have the uh the another bullish uh 3d spike detector in the trading line then we can continue riding that market remember this can be the strategy too uh for the spike uh, 3d spike detector the the one that you are using the one that you are using guys you can continue using it let me give this as an example you can still using the one that you have we have this for the trade line that trades with the vector or 5G. You can use the same system or the same method that we were using. The only one uh, we are changing here, it is the for those people who requested that they and uh, they came up uh, out with a great idea of how you can scalp uh, the using the vector in the middle of 5G or 3D uh, with a strong support or resistance of our trading line and that is why we added now, now that one will be the strategy too for the first one you can continue doing with that one and if you still want to use this strategy too for uh for vector being given direction with our 3g uh, 3d and 5g you can you will use it and it's very accurate guys and thank you so much for those people who shared these ideas and uh, i have been testing and i we saw that uh, Surely it is working great and it is simple as I said, and uh, you can just uh, review that video so that you can have the clear of what to do. And for more details of more explanation, if you still need more clarification about it, guys, uh, don't hesitate to contact us. We can still contact, uh, we can still uh, cover the, the, the thing until it gets in your brain and you become more profitable. And for those people who have the system, please don't forget, guys, to contact me so that I can share you that strategy too uh, for this spike detector. And it's very, very, very accurate and very great. Thank you so much, guys, and thank you for working with us. And we are still doing our best to make sure that everything, uh, every trader is profitable. Don't forget, we have already released our uh Renko for mt4 uh Renko flat on ea it's now out and uh i do believe you will be very very profitable and this time around guys let's make money let's keep jokes aside thank you so much and once again welcome to tfx family we love you and we acknowledge you thank you